Hello everyone, it's me, WillieW52, and today we have a review. On like half the new Burger King set of Angry Bird plushies. So if you guys aren't aware, this year Burger King and Angry Birds in collaboration released a set of like I don't even know how many Angry Bird plushies. Now these plushies are like a hybrid between the Angry Bird movie designs and the original designs. Because on the one hand, they have the movie designs, but on the second hand, they're circles. Every single one of them is a circle, that's including Chuck, and they don't have any bodies. So, yeah. Unfortunately, the Burger King I went to didn't have the full set. They were missing a red. They were missing a red bomb, um, Stella, and like this green hatchling. And so, yeah, so yeah, we're gonna unbox these one by one. So I think fittingly, the first one we should unbox is a uh, blue because he's the second one you unlock in the game, and we don't have red, so I guess he'll be the first. No, I'm gonna. I don't wanna. I'm gonna open the camera this time. I really don't want to cut the plushie on my bed. And, ugh. These scissors are really bad. Eh, let me just. Uh, they gave me an extra bluebird, so I gave that to my little sister. So, yeah. Ugh, so I already know he look how they feel. Well, I'm not, I'm assuming not all of them feel the same. So, eh. Eh. Oh, all oh, is really hard. Okay, this is really hard to do with one hand. Uh. Okay, there we go. I got it out. Uh, so we got Bluebird. Very nice. Uh, he's f very fluffy. Really like him. So I think I'll rate him out of out of a out of one t of one to ten. One out of ten, I think I would have to rate him around a seven. So, let's just put them out right there, and, you know, instead of making you have to watch me unbox every single one of these, I'm just gonna unbox them off camera. So, next up, fittingly, of course, is Chuck, which I'm gonna go off on this plushie. Unlike Blue, who is, I think, is uh, one of the best plushies in the set, I think Chuck is one of the worst plushies in the set. Reason being, he's not a rectangle, he's a circle. Now, I get that Burger King, like, cheaped out and just made them all circles. But still, I don't like this weird, like, face Chuck has. I know that's, like, the face he always, like, makes, but something about it just looks off. And another thing I don't like about these plushies is they have 2D beaks instead of, like, 3D beaks. But, yeah, I can't complain. But yeah, I think this plushie is probably the second worst plushie in the set, and I'll get to the worst plushie in the set later. So for now, we'll just put Chuck right there. And next up, of course, is Matilda. Now, unlike Chuck, Matilda's actually pretty cool. Um, well, I feel like it would have been better if Matilda came in the shape that Chuck is. For some reason, Chuck came out looking like that. I think they tried to make him look like a rectangle, but failed horribly. But, uh, yeah, Matilda looks nice. Uh, she's not as great as Bluebird. Um, she's the only, like, plushie we actually have that's, like, the kind- Not really even the original design. That's sort of, like, the original- Nah, not at all. She's not even the first. Uh, so, yeah, she's just there. Uh, I guess I'll rate her, like, a 6 out of 10. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention, Chuck is, uh, he's like, uh, th he's like a 2 out of 10, he sucks. So, next up is Silver, who is the second ever Silver plush ever made, besides that one giveaway plushie. And, this thing doesn't even look like Silver, it just looks like, oh, looks like kind of like, it just basically looks like Matilda. Same problem with Chuck, she's not like, the same, she's not the same shape. But, yeah, I think this silver is, like, prob- I don't even think- If I ever use her in my series, 
well, if I even make a series, I think I'm just always gonna make just like random up uploads. If I ever use her on one of my videos, uh, she's definitely not gonna be silver because this thing doesn't even look like silver. So yeah, we'll put her right there. And now time for the worst for last. You guys probably saw this coming from a mile away, but in my opinion, Mighty Eagle is the worst plushie in the entire set. He just literally has the same face expression as Chuck. He's like this little circle. He didn't even bother to put brown here. He's just a white little circle. His this, which I don't even know what this is supposed to be. Is it supposed to be hair or like an eyebrow? Because this thing's terrible. And just, I just, I don't, I just don't like this plushie. He looks really bad for Mighty Eagle. I feel like they should have just replaced him with like Terrence or something. I think like Terrence would have been a way better plushie than this thing. Mr. Pink Eye over here. And Matilda fell over. All right. So, oh. See Daisy. So yeah. Oh my god, that's hard. Alright, so there's actually a gimmick with these plushies. These plushies come off a QR code for like an Angry Birds game. And you scan the QR code, and when you scan the QR code, it just basically uh, like it lets you play like an AR like an AR game. And I haven't tried it yet. Uh yeah, hopefully it's like fun or something. It's probably not because it's just like a little cheap promotion. Uh but yeah. Time for the comparison part. So we're gonna be comparing these guys to their original counterparts. So first up is we're comparing Bluebird to the original Commonwealth Bluebird. Now, you can already see which is the obvious better one. This one just has way more detail. It's way more nice looking. It actually has tail feathers or whatever these things are called. And this thing doesn't. And this thing just genuinely looks better. But this is a pretty nice plush too. And next up is Chuck. Chuck is next up and he... Eh, eh, I think it's kind of obvious which plush he is better. I mean, I mean just, just look at this. Um, yeah. I think that Chuck is obviously uh, a thing. This Chuck is 10 times better, and yeah, on to the next plush. Matilda, which I don't even think I should be comparing these plushies because they look nothing alike. I mean, these two at least look a bit similar. So, what? Similar. These two look uh, a little bit similar, but this thing... They do not look any similar. I would, if you told me back in like 2012, if you asked me if this was Matilda, and this was, or this, and this one Matilda, I would say this is Matilda. But obviously, I'm not. What? I'm an idiot. I would, I would say this is Matilda. But nope, this is Matilda. Well, this is Matilda too. But you know what I mean. Yeah. So this thing is not as great as this thing. But uh, next comparison is. Mighty Eagle. Mighty Eagle's next. Oh, all right. He's next because, you know, Silver doesn't actually have any plushie I can compare it to. And there is one plushie, but it's a freaking giveaway plushie, so there's no way I'll even be able to get that. Because that giveaway ended like three years ago. Well, not, no, not three years ago, like five years ago. Anyways, Mighty Eagle compared to. The Commonwealth Mighty Eagle, which is huge. So, I don't even think you need to tell which one is better. I think you can just- I, I think you guys can just guess. I don't even need to say it. I think you guys can just guess which Mighty Eagle is better. So, yeah. So, this is part one of the review of All Might of the new series in- or not, what? Series of Angry Bird Burger King plushies. Uh, I think I'll rate the entire series around a, uh, like a 6 out of 10. But, uh, I forgot to rate Mighty Eagle, and I think I forgot to rate Silver too. So, Mighty Eagle, he's a, he's a 1 out of 10, he's terrible. And I think I forgot to rate Silver, so if I'm, I think I forgot to rate her, so she's a 5 out of 10. So, yeah, 
Honestly, this entire set is a 6 out of 10. In the next episode, we'll be covering some fleshies that, in my opinion, are way better than all of these guys next time, which is the second part of this episode, where we review Red, the Green Hatchling, Stella, and Bob. But next time... Uh, wait, what, what? I'm sorry, this is, I don't have any script for this video, I'm just rambling on. So, yeah, see you next time. Peace.